Chernobyl is the site of the worst nuclear disaster in human history. On April 26, 1986, a reactor at the Chernobyl nuclear power plant in northern Ukraine exploded, releasing large amounts of radioactive material into the atmosphere. The disaster had a profound impact on the environment and the people who lived in the surrounding areas, and its effects are still being felt today, more than three decades later. The Chernobyl disaster was caused by a combination of human error and a flawed reactor design. During a routine test, operators at the plant shut down several safety systems, which led to a buildup of steam in the reactor. When the operators attempted to restart the reactor, a sudden surge of power caused the reactor to explode, releasing radioactive material into the atmosphere. The initial explosion killed two plant workers, and 29 more died within a few months from acute radiation sickness. The explosion also released large amounts of radioactive material into the environment, contaminating a wide area around the plant. The Soviet authorities initially tried to cover up the disaster, but within days, the scale of the disaster had become apparent to the world. In the aftermath of the disaster, a 30-kilometer exclusion zone was established around the plant, and more than 100,000 people were evacuated from the area. The Soviet government also launched a massive cleanup effort, involving hundreds of thousands of workers who worked to decontaminate the affected areas. Despite these efforts, the environmental and health effects of the Chernobyl disaster have been far-reaching. The explosion released more than 400 times as much radioactive material as the atomic bomb dropped on Hiroshima, and the radiation has contaminated soil, water, and vegetation in the surrounding areas. The health effects of the disaster have been difficult to measure, but studies have shown that the people who were exposed to high levels of radiation have an increased risk of developing cancer, particularly thyroid cancer. The disaster also had a significant impact on mental health, with many people who were forced to leave their homes suffering from anxiety, depression, and post-traumatic stress disorder. Despite the challenges posed by the disaster, the area around Chernobyl has become a focus of scientific study and environmental restoration. In recent years, researchers have been studying the effects of radiation on wildlife in the exclusion zone, and there have been efforts to restore the natural ecosystems that were disrupted by the disaster. Today, the Chernobyl nuclear power plant remains a site of significant danger, and efforts are ongoing to contain the remaining radioactive material and prevent further contamination. The disaster serves as a stark reminder of the dangers of nuclear power and the importance of taking precautions to prevent similar accidents from happening in the future. In the years following the Chernobyl disaster, significant efforts have been made to improve the safety of nuclear power plants around the world. New designs have been developed with improved safety features, and regulations have been put in place to ensure that operators are properly trained and that safety systems are maintained and tested. Despite these efforts, there have been other nuclear accidents in the years since Chernobyl, including the Fukushima disaster in Japan in 2011. These events serve as a reminder that nuclear power, while a relatively clean and efficient source of energy, can also be incredibly dangerous if proper precautions are not taken. The lessons learned from the Chernobyl disaster have also had implications for broader discussions about energy policy and environmental protection. Some argue that nuclear power is a necessary component of a low-carbon energy system, particularly as countries work to reduce their dependence on fossil fuels and address climate change. Others, however, argue that the risks associated with nuclear power are simply too great, and that the focus should be on developing renewable energy sources like wind and solar. One of the most visible legacies of the Chernobyl disaster is the abandoned city of Pripyat, which was once home to more than 50,000 people. Today, the city is a haunting reminder of the human toll of the disaster, with schools, apartment buildings, and amusement parks slowly being reclaimed by nature. Despite the radiation, however, the city has also become something of a tourist attraction, with visitors from around the world coming to see the eerie ruins. The Chernobyl disaster was a tragedy that had far-reaching impacts on the environment and on the lives of those who were affected by it. 
Although much has been done in the years since the disaster to contain the damage and to prevent similar accidents from happening in the future, the long-term effects of the radiation released that day will continue to be felt for generations to come. As such, the legacy of Chernobyl is a sobering reminder of the importance of responsible stewardship of our planet, and of the dangers that can arise when we fail to take that responsibility seriously. One of the more positive outcomes of the Chernobyl disaster has been the increased awareness of the need for strong safety regulations and international cooperation when it comes to nuclear power. The disaster highlighted the importance of transparency and information sharing in the event of a nuclear accident, and prompted countries around the world to strengthen their emergency response plans. The Chernobyl disaster also led to a greater recognition of the need for ongoing monitoring and research into the effects of radiation exposure. Numerous studies have been conducted in the years since the disaster to better understand the health impacts of radiation, and to develop more effective treatments for radiation-related illnesses. In recent years, there has been growing interest in the area around Chernobyl as a site for scientific research and environmental restoration. Despite the ongoing radiation, the exclusion zone around the power plant has become something of a laboratory for scientists studying the long-term effects of radiation on wildlife and ecosystems. Researchers have found that, in some cases, the radiation has had unexpected positive effects on the environment, creating a unique and biodiverse habitat for plants and animals that are able to thrive in the absence of human activity. Efforts have also been made to improve the safety of the Chernobyl site itself. In 2016, the new Safe Confinement, NSC, a massive structure designed to contain the remaining radioactive material at the plant, was completed. The NSC is the largest movable structure ever built, and was designed to prevent further leaks of radiation from the reactor. As the years go by, the memory of the Chernobyl disaster continues to be felt in Ukraine and around the world. The disaster serves as a reminder of the risks associated with nuclear power, and of the importance of responsible stewardship of our planet's resources. While significant progress has been made in the decades since the disaster, it is clear that the long-term effects of the radiation will continue to be felt for many years to come. As such, the legacy of Chernobyl remains a sobering and important reminder of the need for ongoing vigilance and care when it comes to our use of nuclear energy. The Chernobyl disaster has also had significant social and political implications in Ukraine and beyond. The Soviet government's initial response to the disaster was widely criticized for its lack of transparency and for putting political considerations ahead of public safety. In the years since the disaster, there has been a greater recognition of the importance of open communication and transparency in matters of public health and safety. The disaster also had a profound impact on the people who lived in the surrounding areas. More than 115,000 people were evacuated from the exclusion zone, and many of them lost their homes and livelihoods as a result. The physical and psychological toll of the disaster has been significant with many people experiencing health problems related to radiation exposure, as well as ongoing trauma and anxiety. Despite the ongoing challenges, there have been some efforts to revitalize the area around Chernobyl. In recent years, there has been a growing interest in ecotourism in the region, with visitors coming to see the wildlife and natural beauty of the exclusion zone. Some entrepreneurs have even started businesses in the area, including a hotel and a coffee shop, in an effort to support the local economy. Overall, the legacy of the Chernobyl disaster is complex and multifaceted. It serves as a stark reminder of the risks associated with nuclear power, as well as the importance of responsible environmental stewardship and strong safety regulations. At the same time, the disaster has also highlighted the resilience of human communities and ecosystems in the face of adversity and the potential for new opportunities to arise from even the most devastating of tragedies. As we continue to grapple with the challenges of climate change and energy policy, the lessons of Chernobyl remain as relevant as ever. While the disaster was undoubtedly a tragedy, it has also spurred new thinking and innovation in the fields of nuclear safety, environmental protection, and public health. As such, the legacy of Chernobyl is both a warning and a source of hope for the future.
The Chernobyl disaster has also had significant social and political implications in Ukraine and beyond. The Soviet government's initial response to the disaster was widely criticized for its lack of transparency and for putting political considerations ahead of public safety. In the years since the disaster, there has been a greater recognition of the importance of open communication and transparency in matters of public health and safety. The disaster also had a profound impact on the people who lived in the surrounding areas. More than 115,000 people were evacuated from the exclusion zone, and many of them lost their homes and livelihoods as a result. The physical and psychological toll of the disaster has been significant, with many people experiencing health problems related to radiation exposure, as well as ongoing trauma and anxiety. Despite the ongoing challenges, there have been some efforts to revitalize the area around Chernobyl. In recent years, there has been a growing interest in ecotourism in the region, with visitors coming to see the wildlife and natural beauty of the exclusion zone. Some entrepreneurs have even started businesses in the area, including a hotel and a coffee shop, in an effort to support the local economy. Overall, the legacy of the Chernobyl disaster is complex and multifaceted. It serves as a stark reminder of the risks associated with nuclear power, as well as the importance of responsible environmental stewardship and strong safety regulations. At the same time, the disaster has also highlighted the resilience of human communities and ecosystems in the face of adversity, and the potential for new opportunities to arise from even the most devastating of tragedies. As we continue to grapple with the challenges of climate change and energy policy, the lessons of Chernobyl remain as relevant as ever. While the disaster was undoubtedly a tragedy, it has also spurred new thinking and innovation in the fields of nuclear safety, environmental protection, and public health. As such, the legacy of Chernobyl is both a warning and a source of hope for the future. One of the lasting legacies of the Chernobyl disaster has been the impact on public perception of nuclear power. The disaster had a profound effect on the public's trust in nuclear energy, leading to increased scrutiny and caution when it comes to the use of nuclear power around the world. In some countries, such as Germany, the disaster led to a complete rethinking of nuclear power policy, with the government announcing plans to phase out nuclear energy entirely. However, in other parts of the world, nuclear power remains an important source of energy, and efforts continue to be made to improve safety and reduce the risk of nuclear accidents. In recent years, there has been renewed interest in nuclear energy as a potential solution to the challenges of climate change, given its ability to generate large amounts of electricity without producing greenhouse gas emissions. Despite these efforts, however, the legacy of Chernobyl continues to cast a shadow over the nuclear industry. The disaster served as a stark reminder of the potential dangers associated with nuclear power, and the need for ongoing vigilance and caution in its use. The Chernobyl disaster also had a significant impact on international relations, particularly during the Cold War. The disaster occurred at a time of heightened tensions between the Soviet Union and the West, and the Soviet government's handling of the crisis was widely criticized by other countries. However, in the years since the disaster, there have been efforts to improve cooperation and collaboration between countries when it comes to nuclear safety and energy policy. The International Atomic Energy Agency, IAEA, for example, was created in the aftermath of the disaster to promote international cooperation and information sharing on nuclear energy and safety. As we continue to grapple with the challenges of climate change and energy policy, the lessons of Chernobyl remain as relevant as ever. While nuclear power has the potential to play an important role in our energy mix, it is essential that we remain vigilant and cautious in its use, and prioritize safety and environmental protection at every step. Ultimately, the legacy of the Chernobyl disaster is a reminder of the importance of responsible stewardship of our planet's resources, and of the need for ongoing collaboration and innovation to address the most pressing challenges of our time of our time.